Yeah, Day knows how to. Day knows how to go. It's super. Five it, one and five zero. Yeah. Woof. Wow. Okay, so we're keeping Digixel up. Yep. Take a breather. That happens. My boy Havoc Noah back in the mix. Day goes into chat right afterwards and says I'm plus on wake up. It's like, all right, we get it. <laughs> Come on, you like this. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> you're, you're a slayer. You're like, come on, bro. <laughs> Alright, let's see how this goes. Stroke oh. the big tree 40 times and then uh, HCL. The Got strategy it. works. Catching jam backdash on top of that. Big counter hit. Yep. Kind of a weird confirm, not going to be able to get optimal damage. Is this mm -hmm. how it begins? No. Yep. I lied. Just wake up VCL. Who would have who who thought? Jabbing him. Woo. There you go. Corner positioning now. So how do you feel this matchup is for Jim? I would feel like it kind of sucks because... It's a, like a lot of jam trying to go under things. But at the same, like you're running into a character that just has like a, a third string projectile. But at the same time, you know, she like out damages her so frequently that it could be that the jam doesn't feel too bad about this. Oh, wow. Six stage. There you go. I was always thinking is that one of the things you might be able to do is just get empowered DPs over and over instead of going for like empowered uh, Ekirins or Ryujins. That's a good point. I didn't even think about that, but I might, that might be very good in this match. And we've seen Jigixel is like he, he's sort of willing to mix it up, right? He's willing to get different cards instead of just the same one over and over. Yeah, it's really interesting to see uh... The kind of tech he has prepared. Mm-hmm. Burst, yeah. I feel like I feel like Noah made a read on there. There was like that walk forward, but just didn't block. He's still in a very good position, though. Yeah, great position. That being uh, having the having the round one within the scent, the best position that he could have been in. Yeah, I mean anything happens after that, and you're you're Eno and neutral with fifty percent meter. You're you're pretty you're pretty all right, honestly. Knockdown. Yeah. That was a really good burst. Yeah, put him in the corner, but the response from Noah was was very strong. Got him out out. It's almost made it negligible. Corner to corner, back uh -huh. in the mix. The more things change, the more they stay the same. One more mix-up. What's it going to be? Oh, oh that no. feels so bad. Stroke the big tree underneath the dead angle. Like, far as, like, hit, like look at the animation. Come on. <laughs> like, just, like, just make it make sense in my head, at least. Ah, <laughs> oh, I feel you. I feel you, Jigsaw. Oh no, got thrown out of the dive. Is it my time to shine? Looks like it. Oh, gold burst. Oh Ow. my, what? <laughs> I'm so upset. Oh, he's got meter though? Yes, dead angle. Oh Wait, no. Oh. I see, wow, nice block, but got the hit afterwards. The card, cross the DP, beats out the wake out VCL, but he doesn't get the full combo. Yes! Nice challenge. What a 2S. Stuffs out the big tree. Front start jump for JH. Oh, wow. Hard read anti air grab. Doesn't get too punished for it. Baits the DP, no punish. Knocked down. Yeah, I earned the burst for that. That's fair. But he's still in the corner. No relentless offense. Yeah, and you see he's going, uh, uh he's just eating these nodes. All right. 
I was gonna say, like, I, I feel like he's going for the notes because of the couple times Jigsaw's done wake up DP. So he's trying to go for a little bit safer of Oki. And he was just looping the setup as long as the Jigsaw wanted to get hit by meaty note. Yeah, I mean, that's not my problem. You should just keep going for it, why not? He gets his wake up baited. A bit of damage. Nice. Run up throw, a very good punish for Goldverse. About the only one you can really, uh, try to get and that's a dead Eno. yeah some good stuff there i mean it, it's a good situation in the corner taking the most out of uh noah's situation where he didn't really have that many defensive options no meter no bursts i mean even if you just hit like a raw dive kick without having the rc you're still just in good situation afterwards so he's just trying to get him to constantly think there you go <laughs> right <laughs> That's all right, doesn't take that time. Here you go. Nice, just willing to block that out, but he needs to find it afterwards. Oh, oh once he again. Does that angle that can, that sucks. It's your favorite. Uh, this hurts a lot, by the way. Yeah, uh-huh. He's got meter for the setup afterwards. Baiting the dead angle. Yes. You blocked it all out. You guessed right the entire time, but just not long enough. All right, got the knockdown. OTG goes for the cross up. Not a full confirm, but he. Oh, all right. Wild in. You got loops. You got loops. I got loops. <laughs> My man is wild in here. I don't even need a note. I don't need projectiles. Oof. Bow. Oh man, oh, the, it took so long <laughs> on the animation that he recovered from stun. But still, the perfect. Yeah, you need a round like that. Punish goes, I like the reset. Put him towards the corner. <laughs> All right, sure, why not, Noah? <laughs> Just to tech jump H. Tried to dive out. I think he tried to go for a throw to Jixel, just like missed the time a little bit. It's a grab. JH is such a button. Yeah. Oof. Oh my god, the note! Goes low. Gonna oh, be able to kill him. Man. Uh, yeah. Jesus, after, after you got your burst thrown like that, ugh. Oh. Fresh baked Colorado burst grabs. <laughs> Shoutouts to JH. Does Colorado specialize in those? Uh, we got a player who goes by Burst Burglar. <laughs> burst Burglar. All right, you know, maybe you guys, wait, does he have like a, like a shop? He's like held up in Denver or something. He just, you know, <laughs> yeah, you have to in. go there to buy your burst back. Yeah, exactly. Just like if you you get it, you get it baited online. You gotta go to FADC. Yup. Yeah, that's how you it works. Legally required to come <laughs> to Colorado and get your, or you can't use it anymore. Okay. Oh, trade. Oh, not in his favor though. Second hit parry whiffs. Yeah, VCLRC, just making sure. And Still then, super. yeah, make it simple. End the round as soon as possible. Reduce the amount of burst gained. There you go, stuffs him out that time. Uh huh, there you go. Good pickup on the combo. There you out go. Of the corner. Yeah. Let the reunion at the end though. Just make sure you get out. There you go. That's what I like. Dejixel now staying out of that range. Trying to force his way in. RC, nice block. Gold burst. There you go. But back in the corner. Dude, he's just trying to force the pace now. He's just trying to get in at any any moment's notice. Do not let Noah have his turn. Yeah, I mean I'm I'm all for it. But the boy will mix you. Yes! Oh no, oh, wow. burst at the last chance! Is he gonna save the game? 
Oh, RC. Can't Out of the corner. One more mix up. <gasps> he traded. He's still alive. Oh, yo, wake up to S. Why? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, all right. All right. You know. Back to the bitch. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, you. Oh, no. Yes. What a pickup. Look at that oh, damage. Look at your life bar. <gasps> is, oh. Is this a dizzy? He's very oh, close to it, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Once again, it's too long. It's way too long. I thought there were, might have been a chance he just lets the first hit of Bow Rock and then he just goes <laughs> for the, the stun reset, <laughs> which would have been so sick. That is the one time I have seen where like Geki, uh, her old uh, her old two hit super might have been better. Yeah. <laughs> like Bow is better in so many other ways, except for the two situations in which Digixel is shown. Like I love Bow, it's so sick. It is way cooler looking than Geki, but it's like beats your stun. Yeah. Jackson oh building. no! Getting as much unburstable damage as possible. Yeah, I like it. <sighs> nope, Again. Not, not this time. That's three times. The mix up tool is the dead angle bait. Ah. Uh, I mean, the it's combo actually. Starter. It's like actually really impressive that Noah's read that many uh, dead angles, right? He's just had the, the stroke ready to go for it. Noah's nice. so good at that sort of thing. He's Oof. just always looking for defensive options. Yeah, I guess when you're Eno, you, know, you have to, right? Because you never want to be on the back foot. You just learn that skill from playing. And Noah plays a lot. Oh, he tried to go for that tech. <laughs> All right, I need you to stop doing it. I need you to stop doing it. It's okay. At best. Oh no! Oh. oh no! This is bad. This is bad. Oh, what a blitz! He so saw good. the meter. He knew the dive kick was gonna happen. Noah taking back the lead, three two. That was that was really good. Wow, that went right over HCL. There you go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know when I'm gonna get used to that. <laughs> it just makes me so upset. <laughs> like, come on, man. It's not a wake up option. Stop making me think it is. Nice grab. Bro. If he gets the hay here, it's gonna be really scary. Yeah, there it is. I'm thinking that you know, if he if he able to had the reset, you might have been able to run it. But there you go. That's just been so back and forth. Yeah, it's been really it's really weird how like momentum shift on like one big hit or one mistake. There you go. Got the blitz. Stroke didn't match out. Oh. Stroke. Yep. Yeah. Trying to bait the dead angle again. There you go. Jixel with the adjustments goes for the cross up. Man, that feels so bad. You have like one of the fastest backdashes in the game. You still get it caught by HCL. Oof. Nice wire C. Mm -hmm. One more mix up. There you go. Got the reset on top of it. That's going to be it. Good stuff. 3-3. Three, three. I like the reset just from straight, you know, went for 2H, left them standing, knew his options. No, taking a second. Yeah. To kind of uh, decompress. And we're back in the game. Let's see, let's see. Jump. Get out of there. Wow, just spent it? Okay. 
I think he maybe he was looking for an HCL there or something, but usually uh, Noah's been playing around making sure that he's like at that range right there or like having meter to wire see it. Whoa, okay. That was great. That was sick. He just needed to confirm. That was so sick. That was way sick. It's just you need to convert it. It needs to have its reward. Oh, and now no Noah. One damage. Yep. What a grab. Uh huh. There we go. Yeah. Noah, not not really afraid to burst any situation. He's Eno. He knows he just needs to get one knockdown. Ooh, Senri takes him all the way. I like the faultless defensing, trying to push him out. Stroke the big tree, not punished. Ooh, plus. Yeah, plus frames on the stroke. H stroke. Woof. Another 2S. Yeah, he's been really good with that. Again, beating the VCL. Oh no! Out of the corner. Uh-huh. There you go. Got the DP. What? Did that auto correct? I'm not sure, but either that one way or another it worked out. And he's just gonna keep going with strokes. Oh, there you go. Wake up long in desperation. That did a lot of damage. The Jack's all full meter though. Yeah, there okay. you go. I I, I like that he finally went for the dead angle once Noah was in the air. He didn't want to get baited by a stroke again. A beat eaters. Oh no. no. So no. much coverage. It's so annoying. Just whiffing those two S's. He's looking for him to run into it with a stroke or something. Air Throw. Out. Scared to move in because Noah was still living green. Ooh, there you go. Oh, come on. Ah. Uh. You don't have perfect right. meaties. Eno's gonna eat your lunch. Ah, it's so upsetting. Noah on step point. Well, it's working. I mean, it's hard for me to say something when it works, <laughs> but I I can still be upset. But it is working. <laughs> so I mean, like, continue to do it. I guess. Johnny makes me upset, but you can just keep doing it, I guess. <laughs> Why not? You're Eno. Just do it. Uh, there you go. RC. Gets the knockdown. Mm hmm. Chase him down. Would, did that look like the beginning of uh, Puffball Super? It did. Huh. All right. Oh, bow. Is there a combo extension? Yes. There you go. It's just barely enough damage. There you go. Crossover. There right. it is again. You know what? Like in this situation, that's not a bad idea because a lot of the times jams will go for card into like a dash of 5H for OK or 5K. I mean, so that's very smart, but it still doesn't make me happy. <laughs> that, 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 that's a possibility. Oh, the return of stroke. DP's through the setup. Good blitz. You see her back one more hit. Yeah. That's a bad situation. Eno's throw after air throw Oki is so good. This could be the set. Yeah, this is set point for him. Low, a little bit too far for full confirm. Oh, six days not quite doing enough. Did Jackson <laughs> didn't expect Noah to get hit there? Or maybe just didn't expect that what the combo is supposed to be afterwards? Because I feel like he made the 2H adjustment because he read the wake up VCL. Oh no. No burst in the yeah. corner against Eno. Gets the dead angle. Yeah, this is another chance for it here. 
Reset, 5D. It's pretty good damage for a 5D, honestly. Oh, there you go. Got the blitz confirmed. No. It's the grab. Okay, okay, okay. He still got the burst, though. I think he's thinking about it, too. He dropped the combo. Gold burst. Yep. Now you have to block Eno with full meter. Yeah, he's just looking for that hit with HCL. Spending all of his meter. One more chance. He blitzed. And that's it. Yeah. Good stuff by Havoc Noah taking the set 5-3. I really like the adjustment there. He's finally trying to blow up that wake up VCL in the same situation, right? A lot of the times you'll see jams go for card and then dash up 5k. So he did two, dash up 2h instead. But he just needs to, to figure out that full confirm. Still a fantastic set. Yeah, fun set still. Fun set still, for sure. And we've only got one left. Fu versus Demendo. Will Fu be able to stop oh Damendo's reign of terror? I'm so scared. This is such a Fu weird situation in terms of like... Just the, the disappearance of life bars. No, it, th this <laughs> is so weird when it comes to like score. It's gonna be great though. Because like D Damendo's up 2-0 in terms of sets. Mm -hmm. And everyone else only has one. So if Fu yeah. wins this, it's a tie and I... I guess we'll just look at game count. Like we don't have a prize or anything, so it doesn't really matter. But yeah, it's just weird. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would say that um, I think, man, I kind of don't want to spoil this, but we don't really have we don't really have a rule set for it, so it doesn't matter, right? Right. And there's no prize, so it doesn't. I was gonna say that like the I would think that Day would still come out victorious because he has like the most wins round wise like he won 5-0 and 5-1 yeah that's what it'll come down to and like right Fu's win versus Noah was last game so he probably wouldn't be able yeah. to win so in the end like he has the most you know win loss rounds but at the same time you know like I said who really cares we're here to watch some good guilty gear so it's been mighty fine guilty gear it's been pretty fun you know I've I've really enjoyed this me too because it's just been scrambly sometimes and fun. There's been a lot of good adjustments. So I, I've had a lot of fun with this one. I also really like watching Day. Day is like just is is a uh, I mean he he's he's the premier Slayer player, right? Like that's the guy we look at when we think of like one of the best Slayer players in the US. He's distilled what makes that character scary into a fine art form. Yeah. I I absolutely agree. It looks like we're about to get started. Do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. So, this will be interesting. I wonder if um So I, 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 if I remember correctly, Fu used to play against a Slayer quite a bit, so I feel like he might have the matchup experience, but I mean, you know, it's day. Like, right. You know, the matchup experience only goes so far uh, when you're playing against the best. Knowing, I mean, at some point when you're a guy like Fu who's traveled so much and known and, and has played a lot of games versus a lot of people, you know, matchup experience is is uh sort of expected and then you're just sort of playing against the player at this point right still chilling out in that button check zone yeah all right let's see this one let's see is foo gonna make a is foo gonna make this another ninth game are we gonna get one of those again or is day gonna do his patented uh Five and five and go five and one <laughs> make it quick because uh, all of Fu's games have gone the distance and all of days have gone as almost quick as possible. Days looking to make a speed run out of this tension pulse. I'm for it. I mean, he's he's this dominant of a player. I'm, but I'm also you know I would like to see someone put up a fight. Let's see if someone can can stuff him out. Who's a unique player? Like he, he's sort of got a different rhythm than most other Guilty Gear players. 
So it could, it could throw him off a bit. All right, that's unique. That was really unique. <laughs> unique burst timing. Oof. There you go, just letting that tuner ball rock. Just hold the neutral down. Don't let Mappa in or anything like that. He's got full meter, yes. All right, we spent a little bit. Nice blitz on that slate. Missed the combo though. Bates the blitz. Mm -hmm. Knock down, tuner ball. Ooh, full loose finds a way. What was that blitz? I don't know what happened. Oh. I think he might have been mashing and then just like in tech accidentally landed and then got a blitz. That's unfortunate, but first round goes today. Knock down. See how much respect Day has for the tuner ball setups. Chase the knockdown. Oh, he tried. He tried to chase it down, but BDC and the dandy just got him out of range. So much damage. Uh, there you go. Kept it burst safe as best yeah. as he can. It was going to be really hard to find an opportunity to. All right, first one. This is like it was that first round was decently close. Let's see what Fu is thinking about. What adjustment he's gonna make? Footsies. Oh what? Okay. Oh no! No! Help! I... What? <laughs> Did you see that 6-H? It was in slow-mo! What happened? Danger time is a mystery to us all. That was like, he got the hit, he got the trade, and he mashed out the 6-H, and it wasn't like he wire seated it or something. What? Okay. Alright, fine, sure. <laughs> Here come the orbs. Oh my... God. Day, are you serious with the blocks? That defense was so godlike, but not quite enough. Wow. All right, so we, you know, I feel like we just skipped forward into that round, or just like you know, just skip like eighty percent health in, yeah, <laughs> and just let's go, let's go from there. Oh, <laughs> oi! Oh, I missed the last one. Goes low. Big red kicks. Oh, he tried to re blitz. Missed the Shashinkin. But he's in the corner. He's just trying to control him. Just trying to be a wall here. Wow. I don't Back think in the it. corner. Yeah. All right. You know what? Life lead made up. No big deal. I'm Slayer. He's got meter too. That's the scary part. Yes! Pass the burst. Yeah, there you go. Wow, another chance. That's two in a row that Day is blocked. Day did a really good job of trying to stay in the air. So Yeah, just chicken guard it. It does take a lot of chip, but, you know, not that big of a deal, all things considered. Oh! Wow! The air blitz! That's not enough! He needs a pixel! What? That's a two-piece! He's looking for it! Just run into it! It doesn't work out! Chips him out. Oh! He just mashed it. He legit... There was like seven two-piece in like maybe two <laughs> seconds. <laughs> Oi, oh, counter it. Knockdown. Red ball set up. That is... All right, all right. I'm impressed. Good backdash. Right, slide in. There you go. You tried to go for something tricky there, but that was a nice mash out from Fu. Red yes. balls both coming this way. <gasps> he tried to confirm off it, and then the blitz. He thought he was going to be able to stuff it out. 1-1. 
he thought the Hayabusa was gonna come in there, but he just two D and just out of range. That was so <laughs> such a wild last round, last moment. Oh. Uh. I can't believe Heyhoon just called Slayer four string, whatever that. Is it a foy? Did he call him four strings? Yeah. All right, Fu, I need you to win another round so I can see that. That's disrespectful. Oh no! All right, that's that. That burst makes sense. Scary burst. Or just like, can someone stand still for a second? Like it's just like wake up six H and just blitzing back and forth. <laughs> I love this. This is great. <laughs> oh, nice wire, I see. Flare has a lot of meter. Yeah, this is scary. He's forced a mix up here with the paw bunker. That was so sick. He, like, actually kept the tuner ball outside of his wake up range and, like, went for a mix up. But it was almost so scary that, like, they didn't want to do anything. The fakest DP of my life. What is the properties on blue DP? The invincible in some degree? I'm not quite sure, actually. I know it's pretty fake, but I don't know exactly how fake off the top of my head. Oh, no! Uh-huh. Just upper body? Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah, upper body, uh, first four frames, above knees, uh, three frames after that, and then after eight frames, full and full. Man, and in the time we found the answer to that question, Slayer took... <laughs> third life real quick, no big deal. What? Great crosswise. I saw the 5k start, yeah. Alright, use red ball, keep him locked down, got the throw. There you go. Ooh, what an answer. That was nice. Usually, Fu likes to go for that at least once. He goes for the tech into tuner ball and see if he can deal with it. I think Day uses Blitz better than any other player I've seen in a very long time. Yeah, it's, it's very impressive. Oh, wow. That spacing was so good. Good just defending. He gets him out, but got hit afterwards. Crosswise heal for the confirm. He's got 50% to force the mix up, but he gets hit by the it's late. Counter. Can't believe Slayer's trying to eat robot blood. Your blood has no taste. What does that mean? Does that mean that he, like, one, Heihun has blood? And two, that it's like, it's not actually blood? What is what power is Heihun? I thought it was like key hey. or something. I didn't know. No, the Heihun robot is powered by Fresca. <laughs> That's why it has no taste. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. That's definitely canon now. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Knockdown. A lot of meter on day side though. Oh no! Oh, yeah. Ow. You know. Ow. Why not, right? Just mash out the pile bunker. What's the worst gonna happen? I have 100 meter. Okay. All right. Gober's connecting. Yeah, I can start off scary. Crosswise. Yes, eternal yeah. wings for the confirm. I like it. What a bait. Yeah. <laughs> Eternal wings. <laughs> Try you know, bursting one of those six piece. You know, like I don't get to use that super often enough anyway, so why not? Just go for it. <laughs> take it. I mean, yeah. Take a second, breathe. I guess you know that round went kind of fast. And those rounds kind of suck when you're a player because you kind of want every round to go 
a certain length to learn about what your opponent's doing. So when you just get bodied like that, you feel like you get no information. You just right. lose. It's just, it feels like a waste of a round. Yeah, exactly. It's bad for your overall mental game. Not just because yeah. you didn't get the information, but it feels like you're at minus momentum going into the next one. Yeah, it definitely takes a strong player to like look at that round and just be like, you know what? Slayer players, let's go. Yeah. Next round. <laughs> RC, if we get the combo. All right. Ooh, the 2H. Ooh. I wonder if he just wanted to go for a really active button in that situation. Just go for something that has like a ton of active frames. So if like he wants to go for a dandy in the corner or a backdash into something, he still gets clipped out. Definitely worked out pretty well. Yeah. Getting counter hit by that orb. Orbs don't have any blood. Slayer doesn't know what to do. <laughs> That would be really, like, messed up, but also funny if, like, Bite didn't give him health. Yeah, against Hey you yeah, and Robo guys. Just, just Hey you specifically. Yeah, gotta give that property to my man Robo Kai when he gets put in the game. I'm for it. It'd be great. Hachi, come on. Or make it, like, temporary health or something. I don't know. Like, just, like, make it not real health. <laughs> That'd be great. I'm all, I'm all for it. You know, if we get Robokai. Yeah, there is a classical four string gut. I have no idea how you look com complete. <laughs> is this like not all of Slayer? <laughs> that was a uh, procedurally generated win quote. Yeah, maybe. They plugged Hey Hyun into a neural network, and that's what came out. <laughs> oh wow, the clap! Ooh, Amazing. that was so sick. Good blitz. Oh, you hate when that happens. Yeah. Especially in that situation where he didn't have any meter to re-blitz, there's almost no reason not just go for a tap blitz combo. Oh, all right. That was some next level shit. That was impressive. Oh, Ooh. the orb movement just a little bit off. Uh-huh. You gotta block this. There you go. Who trying to tie it up? Whoa, okay. Tried to anti air with the 5B. <laughs> oh, the crosswise again beating the tuner ball. Unfortunately for Day, Fu is just a little bit too high in the air for the term. Yeah. Crosswise. Bite. There you go, Ooh. response. Yeah, I feel Out like... <laughs> Foo did it, Foo won. Oh, man. Good job for Foo, congratulations. The, the otherworldly Blitz Wars. That was crazy. Foo gets the Blitz trophy. Oh. Got the throw. He still got the burst. <gasps> he, right, but there was gold, so he couldn't do anything about it. Ah, he's gonna be close. Oh, Jesus, Foo, the king of the blitz. The king of the blitz. That was some otherworldly blitz wars. That was wild. Fu is now a, like a veteran of the Blitz Wars. That's like he's he is weathered. Fu oh. his purple heart. Yeah. Oh, after Blitz Warring with Slayer, yeah, I, I'd say so. All right, the so big chase now. RC for the combo, but you earned the burst for it. 
Not a bad idea considering that he has 50, 7,500 percent. Oh, that was going to hurt. Saves, tries to save the round here, but it's not going to matter. California burst if I've seen one. <laughs> Both players looking real lean on burst meter going. Yeah. Woo! Ooh. Huh. Ooh. I have to think that might have been an axe kick, but I don't know what that would have led to anyway. So it's like. Who knows? You know, I. I, I yeah, who knows? Uh huh. Just dusting him. Yeah, nice reset too. Using the tuner ball to keep him locked down. To Pete. Oh, we missed the OTG. There you go. It's not going to matter. On block. Then chip him out with the tuner ball. They did get burst back though while Fu is pretty far away. Very true. Oh, the 6P went the wrong way. Oof. Held oh. it that time. Let's go, Fu. Yeah. That was a blue one. Tried to get the confirm after it. Clap. Made is that it. a button? Yes. Ooh. 2K. Sends a full screen. Yes, there you go, Fu. Once again, Fu's use of tuning orb to move in with Grandpa Viper is so on point. It's so annoying. And like, if you don't have something that will stuff him out before he gets you there, it's like, it's, I don't think it's like, I don't think you can deal with it, really. But you have to have something that will like stuff him out before he shows up. Now, I don't really see any other Heihunes using Fu does. Yeah, it's that's why I, like I love to say that he has some of the best ball control in the game, and it's like not just like the movement left and right; it's also the uses as well. My man Fu definitely knows how to handle an orb. There we go. Oh, he counter hit, not in either's favor. It's able to get a little bit of Oki. Oh, okay, okay. He got hit by the first tuner ball, and then he gets the reset. Oh my god, Fu got the throw! This is set point? Will this Fu? is set point! Take Fu's... down Damon Doe. I'm pretty sure this is this will be three straight if he gets this. It's at least two for now. Block on the it's late. Not out of the corner just yet. What a bait with the dandy. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's wow. that's a Damendo round. Sometimes you just die. Oof. Direct hit didn't do it, but the 2P will afterwards. It's not quite a perfect, but it might as well be. Damendo trying to keep himself alive. Nice pile bunker. Not the, not the punish he was looking for, but it is damage, I guess. Oof. Nice confirm. Clap. Put him in the corner. Yes. I like it. Uh-huh. First then, back. Yeah, that was a lot of damage. Wow, 6P through overhead. <laughs> Hit him with the tuner ball. There it is right there. This hurts. He's got meter oh, counter hit. That's it. That's a dead Heihun. Yeah, with 50% more, he got stunned on top of it. Dang, Mendo keeps himself alive. We're going to the last one. And uh, I guess the Fu prophecy came true. Because we're going to the last one instead of uh, the quick Damendo games. What a set. It's been a good set. Game nine. That means uh, Fu will have had played in these round robins. This will be his 27th game now. What a champion. <laughs> That's crazy. 27 competitive matches. Oh, he held it longer! <laughs> that sucks! Slayer gets tossed. Blitz gets baited. Um, oh my god, the mix-ups. RC to keep the pressure up. He's in the corner. And he just wakes up with the Helter Skelter. Gold burst, though. Day. Yeah, take him to the other corner. This is where you're supposed to stay. Wow, what a tick grab. 
Backed up. Look at the control. He's willing to play it. Woohoo! <laughs> Let the tuner ball do the dirty work. <laughs> that was so sick. Yeah. Alley looped himself. Yeah. Oof. Day's not out of it just yet. So scary. Yeah, and he's just playing with him in the corner. I don't care if you just defend oh. these. Slayer, am I right? Oh my god, after all that risk. Yeah. Oh! Bit. Well. He didn't even get his burst back. Yeah, that was quick. And it's got to go this way, right? It's got to go final round. Oh, there you go. More Blitz Wars. He earns the burst for it. Couldn't quite steer him into the tuner ball. Wow. Try to punish. Nice to punish. Yeah, a little bit too far. He's going to use the super. Oh, no. The dead angle goes the wrong way. Got the punish and the knockdown. I didn't block that empty low. That's nope. it. Good the job. Clap. Ooh. To H? Yes, sir. Foo, the person able to take down Day. So nobody is perfect on this night. Good stuff to him. <laughs> All right. So that was sick. That was sick. Congratulations to Foo. I guess we'll call it a tie, maybe. I don't know, because he beat the person who was in the lead. They're both champs in my heart. Yeah, that was a, a good set. That means, man, that means Foo played 27 games. Competitive games. I think. That was crazy. I think Day would probably win. Just like. Probably still. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I think he probably won more games overall, especially because he brought that game, that match so close. Yeah. If like if every game went uh to the final game, that means that Fu is only plus one. Yeah. And that and means uh, day is like. Plus yeah, five, actually, yeah. All eight. all of Fu's sets went to the last game, huh? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Yeah, you're right. They won the same amount of games. Seriously. They won the yeah. So that's like it depends on how you want to do it because they did win the same amount of games. But oh, I get. They, yeah, they didn't lose that, the same that makes of games. sense. Yeah. Yeah. I guess. I don't know. It. Yeah. Okay. I, I. I like Shinsen's ruling. Actually, it's two two, but they fought each other and Fu won, so that's a tiebreaker. Sure. Okay, we'll, we'll, mean... we'll, we'll go with that. <laughs> yeah. Sure. It's kind of no, hard I mean... to do one of these with four people. Yeah. Exactly. You know. And all things considered, we we set up the first of five so that we can have like some great sets over and over again, and more than just like two games, right? All people adapt and adjust. Yep. Yeah, that was thick. So, was um, we have one match for next week. So, f so far, it's GC Yoshi versus Elven Shadow. Ooh. Which, which was an old rivalry back in sign, but I haven't seen it in a hot minute. So, yeah, I'm definitely excited to see that one again. Yeah, I'm uh, looking forward to it. Yeah, me too. Not quite sure who's going to be playing in the other match, but we'll let you guys know as soon as that's confirmed. Mm -hmm. Lot, lots of pog champs in the chat. <laughs> um, and we also here. Let me go through the ads first, real quick, before we sure. do anything else. Remember, Super TSB is next month on uh, April nineteenth and twentieth. Michigan Masters on April 12th through 14th. And Low Kick Super Saturday is Season 3 every week in Chicago. But we also have a video. So I'm going yes. to um, I'm gonna deafen. Turn off my mic and you guys can hear that.
Okay. Yo. <laughs> Tension pulse is the sixth fate. Tension pulse is the sixth fate. <laughs> so, we're doing BB tag tension pulse. Uh, I'm not streaming it. Uh, our streamer is in the voice call right now, and it's Faith. Hello. Hello. So, uh, she's going to be streaming once every two weeks, not okay. every week. And this isn't going to take the place of GG at all. It's going to be on mm -hmm. a separate day. Here, let me turn her up. But yeah. Um, so our first our first stream is going to be on next Tuesday with GG. But after that, it's going to be every Thursday, every other Thursday. Okay. And uh, Christina, do you want to tell everyone what the matches are? I can. Uh, hold on, let me tell you which one is first, just so you don't ruin the other one. Just in case. Okay. You good? Yes, I'm good. Okay. So go for it. Anyway, the first match we have is gonna be our Bondo versus Omni Sun. Yeah, that should be, be really good. fun. They've definitely played before on their streams. I don't think it's happened in a while, but they're both really strong, so it's just a nice way to start with. Yeah, definitely. Our second match, which will be the main event for sure, we got Fame and... Oh, where'd it go? It's not showing up. Hold up. I'll just put the image on here. It's fine. There we go. Yeah, Fame and Jan. I think you're a push to talk cut off. Yeah, Fame and Jan. Okay, oh, sick. And both Which is super high. Yeah, that that's gonna be a super high profile match. Whoa, Jan plays Rockin'. I can't tell if you're joking or not. <laughs> Jan plays. <laughs> Jan Jan is definitely a top player in BB Tag. So yeah, uh, because because the game is so fast, it'll be first to ten. Uh, Damn. Yeah, that's gonna be crazy. Two two first to tens. Um, our first round of commentators is Ebonic Plague and Bojack. Uh, the people participating in this may or may or may not have actually realized that this was for tension pulls because we didn't tell all of them <laughs> <laughs> on purpose, but still. <laughs> <laughs> so You're just like, hey, do you want to play nondescript first to ten against this other guy? <laughs> I I literally told people I want to stream some first to tens. So will you do this? And they were like, yeah, sure. Let's. Why would why would they say no? <laughs> so yeah, um, this is our new thing. Uh, me and Baze have definitely been like dying to announce this, so I'm glad we finally got to do it. <laughs> Jan, Jan actually traded a work shift to do this. That's dope. Yo. That's mega dope. Well, I appreciate it because Jan's uh, one of my favorite players to watch because I like big bodies. Oh, someone told someone told Arm he was fighting fame. Someone fucked up. Well. You did fuck up. Surprise. <laughs> You're not. <laughs> 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 You got a week, so time to make adjustments. So yeah, um... It'll be fine, he's good. Yeah. They're, they're all good players, it shouldn't matter too much. But yeah, um... Unlike Surprise, when we... here's your match! Yeah. <laughs> unlike when we did, uh, Dragon Ball a while ago, it definitely should not, uh, conflict with our GG planning, because right. we have separate people to work on it. And also, Dragon Ball kind of, like, the online exploded. So right. that just crashed and burned, and then we sort of didn't pick up steam from there. But yeah, we're going to try to be consistent with both games. Yeah, it looks good. Um, note the time, 7.30, so it'll be after uh, Tension Pulls GG on Tuesday. Yeah, it's going to be uh, 10 p.m. Eastern. Uh, oh, 10, right. This is the first set, or yeah. second set, I mean. Yeah. Yeah. Um, where is it? Yeah, there's the first one. And let me just 
cut paste the stream in there. So yeah, also yeah, go so ahead and give... a different stream. Give her a follow. Yes. Yeah, give her a follow. That way you know when it's live. And you don't even have to worry about where to go afterwards. Oh yeah, and thank you to uh, Amadeus for recoloring the logo and Yet's Shiki for making that awesome trailer. Can't believe we're esports enough to actually get trailers. That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> we were we were like actually losing our minds earlier when we saw how good that looked. So thank no, you, it Shiki. Was really, it was sick. Yeah. For the community, by the community. That's why these are awesome. But yeah, um, I think that's that's it. Uh, I should host someone. But aside from that. Yeah, I think we're done for the night. Sweetness. Glad right. we got a bunch of uh, viewers. I'm not sure if if Twitch actually counted this stream as my 12th day of streaming, so it might not give me partner, but I should get it this week at worst. All right. <laughs> but yeah. Well, let's hope. Okay. Uh, All let right. me host the beautiful dude. All right. I guess we'll sign out then. Yeah. Thanks for commentating, guys. Yeah, thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Likewise. And All right. Take you. it easy, y'all. Have a good one. Good night. Good night.